Try this next time you're at the range getting ready for hunting season. What's up guys, Phil here. Just got done sighting in my 6.5 PRC in preparation for my Alaska caribou hunt that I have in a couple weeks. And I just wanna run you through a real quick tip this hunting season. Now, as a competitive shooter, I love this rear bag. This is a OG game changer with Git light, but realistically, I'm not taking this on a hunt. So what you could do instead of using a bag like that while you're training, getting ready for the season is use three other or maybe even four other techniques for rear support. The first technique is using your bino harness and all I'm gonna do, so I've got a target here at 600 yards and I'm just going to use that bag to help fill in that negative space there. I'm not gonna rest my rifle completely on it. I'm only resting my hand on top of the harness, allowing me to fill that gap between the ground and my buttstock. <sighs> Impact. So that is one rear support that you could use. Another one, this is a stone glacier uh, surf jacket just rolled up in, into the hood, right? So this could be a stuff sack of anything of that nature, whatever the case might be, just rolled up. Again, maybe your top lid. All you're doing is filling in that negative space. <sighs> Impact. And you see my recoil management is pretty good on point. My favorite, this is tripod rear. So if you got a glassing tripod, you put this on your right side of your body or maybe your spotter. Now I'm gonna bring that underneath me here. And what you're gonna see is I'm gonna go ahead, and pull it until it pinches up against the buttstock. And then we're gonna squeeze it and pinch both of them together. And you can see there in my reticle, that thing is rock solid. Just be careful because you have some hard on hard contact here. So recoil management might not be as forgiving as the first two, but let's check, take a look at it. All right. So a little bit more left movement, but I did achieve an impact, right? And then, so that is another great technique. And my favorite is if you don't have a rear bag and you're just relying on your rifle to shoulder connection, good breathing, good fundamentals. Impact. No rear bag. So something to try out. This hunting season as you're getting ready for rifle season. Thanks guys, and remember you have control.